Hey, how's it going? My name is Omar. We're here at Function Core Fitness. Today, this is the, uh, the today's video is going to be the third video of a three-part series of the leg circuit. If you haven't checked out the other two, the uh, sagittal plane, the frontal plane, go to YouTube, Function Core Fitness. Uh, you will see the other uh, two videos there. Now, today's video okay, is going to be extremely difficult because we are in the uh, transverse, or we're going to do the transverse plane of motion exercises. Okay, this is the plane of motion that the majority of people, number one, neglect, and number two, because they neglect it, this is the plane of motion that the majority of people commonly injure themselves. Okay, when they jump like basketball, they pivot, their knees and ligaments or tendons aren't used to the, uh, that, that plane of motion, so a lot of times they tear, ACLs, it happens all the time. So, it's extremely important that you really, really focus on all three planes of motion, and especially working on this, uh, this plane of motion, the transverse. Okay? Very neglected, it should be, it should be the most important plane of motion. Okay, so going back to the uh, three different or three same exercises the balance, the strength, and the power. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing with single leg. We're gonna do the lunges in the transverse plane and also the power in the transverse plane. Now, the transverse plane balance, okay, is gonna be very difficult. So I'm going to face the cone, balance on one leg, reach with the opposite, I'm going to jump. Okay, as I jump in the air, I'm going to rotate, you know, rotate, land on the other leg, and I'm going to touch the cone. Okay, very simple. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and do 12 on each side, 24 total. Okay, oh, I'm sorry, 15, so 30 total. So the transverse balance uh, reaches. Now the second one is going to be the transverse lunge, okay? So you can do it kind of two different ways. I'll show you the, the easier way. I'm facing forward. I'm going to take a big step, pretend I'm in a clock. I'm going to take a step in the four o'clock position, keeping my front foot pointing forward. I'm going to lunge, stand back up, alternating, going to the eight o'clock position, lunge, come back up. Okay, that's gonna be the easier one. Okay, the harder one, which incorporates a pivot, again, 12 o'clock, facing four, pivoting, lunging, standing up, pivoting back to 12, and back to my starting position. Taking a big step, pivoting, lunging, reaching, standing, pivoting, back to my normal position. Okay, so let's go ahead and do 24 of those, 12 on each side, transverse lunges. Now, the transverse power is going to be, I'm going to put one foot on top. Remember, I'm pushing off this foot here, the leg, that, the leg that's on top. I, I'm gonna jump, boom. Now I'm gonna face that direction. Come back up, face that direction. Back and forth. Please be very careful with the landing. Extremely important that you land soft. Don't land hard, okay? So that's gonna be your power transverse jumps, okay? So, so far we've done the single leg balance, the, the uh, transverse lunge strength, and the transverse uh, box jumps, which is going to be your, you know, the, the final exercise. So that's your third plane, the third video. Please check out the sagittal plane, front, the frontal plane video, side to side, and now this one, the transverse. Thank you. Please visit functionalcorefitness.com. Self-defined clothing or self-defined.com and superbodycare.com. I hope you enjoyed today's video and the three-part series. If you have any questions, you can always uh, Facebook me and become a fan at Functional Core Fitness. Thank you. Have a